Hi, welcome back. In this video, we will see how to run uh, our Cypress tests in uh, uh, GitHub Backsends. Okay, so for that, uh, I have committed uh, uh, my code into GitHub first. So all all the code that we have uh, written till now uh, uh, in all my videos, I have committed to GitHub. Okay, so after that, uh, in your in our project um, uh, in in root folder. We, we need to create um, uh, one folder uh, with name um, dot github and uh, inside that folder we need to create a one more folder uh, with name uh, workflows okay uh, this is mandatory we have to create a dot github and then um, uh, we need to create a wor uh, workflows uh, folder okay so after creating work workflows uh, folder then inside our workflows folder uh, we need to create an uh, ml file so we can give any name so i am giving um, cypress um, uh, hyphen youtube dot uh, uh, yml so we need to create a yml inside uh, yml file inside workflows uh, folder okay so now let's see um, we need to write some uh, commands here um, uh, to execute uh, uh, this our cypress tests in um, uh, workflows folder okay so first the first one is we need to provide some name uh, we can give as a cypress tests uh, youtube record and then um, the second one is on so uh, on, on push uh, uh, whenever we push our uh, uh, code to github we need to run um, you know, we are instructing the uh, uh, github actions to run uh, uh, all these cypress tests and then uh, we need to configure the jobs what what it needs to be run okay so uh, so to run the jobs so here we need to uh, provide um, uh, some job name that is uh, cypress hyphen run we can give and after that um, uh, we need to uh, specify the um, environment on which uh, environment um, uh, it, it should run like uh, ubuntu uh, hyphen um, uh, latest and then um, we need to provide some uh, steps here okay so after that um, in the steps we can provide the name the first one is um, uh, we need to check out the code so for the checkout um, um, uh, we need to use uses uh, accents uh, slash checkout uh, at v3 okay and then the second second action that we need to do is um, we need to give a space indentation is mandatory uh, uh, in ml file so we need to run uh, uh, test cypress so um, uh, cypress so run and then we need to use uses here and then um, here um, cypress has provided uh, some github accents so we need to use a cypress provided uh, uh, github accents cypress uh, hyphen uh, io slash github uh, accent at the rate uh, version 5 okay so we need to provide these steps um, uh, to run our um, uh, tests in um, uh, github action okay so after this uh, uh, once we save uh, see it's uh, auto align and then um, uh, we need to commit uh, our code to github so i am committing using my um, visual studio code itself so adding um, 
added uh, github uh, actions ml file and then i'm committing it so after commit we need to uh, publish to uh, uh we need to push the code to uh, git re, uh, github re, uh, repository so here it will show as a sync changes so uh, in vs code it will show like that or otherwise you can use um, uh, commands also git push uh, origin um, uh, main something like that okay so if i go to uh, my browser and if i refresh the page there you can see github um, uh, um, slash workflows folder and then it has a cypress hyphen youtube.yml so if you go to um, github accents see now it's already started executing so added github accents uh, ml file so if you uh, click on that one it will see um, see the first job we have run is cypress run okay so the checkout is the default one there yeah you can see the setup uh, and then the check checkout one and then the now cypress tests are running so you can see that uh, uh, it has 25 files it started executing um, uh, those files so by default it will run um, uh, a cypress run command See the tests are started executing here. It, it takes some time. So I'll pause the video and uh, once it completes, I will get back to you. can see the test execution got um, uh, completed here so uh, if you expand that one uh, it shows the summary uh, at the end um, so how many test cases got passed uh, how many were um, uh, failed okay if you see uh, if you navigate um, at the end so same like uh, uh, in our um, uh, command command pro command line so it is all, it all, here also it will show um, all the report here so out of um, uh, 52 tests um, uh, 51 are passed um, uh, one, one is uh, failed here so here the children notes got failed maybe uh, in the website the data got changed so here we are verifying uh, some specific data so it's a public website so people may be uh, changing some data so that's why it might have failed so in this way you can uh, run um, uh, a cypress tests in uh, github action um, so in the next video we will see how to run um, uh, these tests um, uh, parallelly in um, uh, github action thank you